Hello everyone and welcome to match build up between Liverpool and Huddersfield. This kickoff is at Wednesday at 7.45. Hopefully we can get ourselves a win. First thing I'm looking forward to seeing is seeing more of Woodburn. He was very good in the last two games and hopefully, hopefully we can see a bit more of him. Obviously, I'm not going to hype him up too much because he is a 16 year old lad, but he's, been very well, he's done very well. Two goals, can't complain at that. Two goals and an assist and very well taken goals as well. So he's done very well. Hopefully he can keep it up. Another two players I'd like to say the same thing about, Grujic and Kent, they've been very good. Obviously, Grujic was ill for the last game, unfortunately, but it's great to see him again because he's been, his first game, his first 45 minutes, he was quality, top quality. He looked the player that we expect him to be in about four years. He didn't look the player that we expect him to be now. I was expecting a lot worse. Seems quite a bad thing to say, but I suppose it's a good thing at the same time because I, I was expecting worse. We've got better, which is quite nice. Kent as well. Kent's been very good. I've been really impressed with him. Hopefully he can keep it up going all the way into the season and maybe force himself into a spot on the bench. I'd also like to see some senior players step up a little bit. Firmino's not been great. Obviously he scored two goals, but he does look fatigued, which is quite which is quite disappointing. But hopefully throughout preseason, that is the point of preseason, get players' fitnesses back up and hopefully try and improve improve the way they play. So you can see Klopp's system already coming into play. You can see the way that the players are working together. It is already improving. Hopefully Matip isn't injured. It'd be, great, it'd be great to see more of him. Unfortunately he got injured obviously at the end of the game. I don't know how serious that is. Hopefully it's not very serious he can play this game. Probably won't be ready for this game. But maybe the game against Chelsea on the 28th I believe. You might play in that one. So hopefully he can do that. Okay it's night time for my starting 11 predictions. So start off Karius in goal. Standard obviously it's going to be Karius in goal. Massive and Lovren centre backs to try and get them three working together as much as possible. Right back, John Flanagan. Left back, Moreno. Centre mids, Grujic and Brannigan. Want to see more of those two together. They look very good. Mane, Coutinho, and Kent as a three behind the striker. I'm not too sure what positions they'll be in. You'll see it on the screen. I'm going to put it in positions, but I really don't know what kind of positions they'll play. And then Woodburn up front. I'm going to go for Woodburn. Hopefully, he can get himself a start in a stronger, stronger squad and see what he can do in that as well. So now, score predictions, I'm going to go for a 2-0 Liverpool win, why not? Hopefully it can be more, but it'd be nice to see how the players react to going 1-0 down, you know, to be fair. I really would like to see that. Obviously, as a Liverpool fan, I'd never want to see Liverpool losing. But at the same time, I'd love to see how will the players react if they do go 1-0 down in the game. And to try and pull it back, it'd be nice to see, but... We never know. Anyway, give me your starting 11 predictions in the comments below. And also, your score predictions would be nice to see. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. Any suggestions on how I can improve this? Obviously, this is my first time ever doing this. So, I'm very new to it. And I'm getting used to the, what, what to say and how to word things. And you know what I mean. So, I really hope you've enjoyed. And just give me some suggestions. So, I shall see you all on my next video, which will be a transfer daily or match reaction.